Well, greetings. So, it's been a while since I did one of these, but I keep there always seems to be someone in the I either IRC Discord for OpenSUSE or the IRC channel for OpenSUSE or the Discord server for OpenSUSE complaining, Oh, the NVIDIA driver is so hard, the repo is broken, but the NVIDIA driver is so hard. It's not, people. Come on. So, I just uh, updated this machine. The kernel got an update, and, uh, well, NVIDIA driver it has a major update, including some Vulcan stuff and some other features that I kind of want. So I need to do an update. That and usually whenever there's, I time the kernel updates to whenever there is a new NVIDIA driver. And it's been about a couple weeks now. It is the 29th and I think there was an NVIDIA release on the 17th. So... Let me get into the folder, cd bin, uh, and the command that you use is sh in I use nvidia star dot run dash e. Uh, Except that isn't going to entirely work right now. So for fifteen, because I know I've got four fifteen on here, star, and that should launch the one that I need. Bingo. Boy did I hit that one on the nail. The stars really help a lot if you don't remember the entire one. So what I had done is I wgetted from uh, the HTTP uh, reposit or directory where NVIDIA has all of their in, uh, Unix drivers. So we get into this concurrency, that's fine. Oh, yeah, that's right. has to be done as root. Four fifteen dot star dot run, although technically I could just copy and paste. No, oh, damn it. So In that case, let's just copy and paste this command again. Boop. There we go. That works. Okay, so yeah, I'm definitely out of date, as you can see here. So. If you're installing fresh, you won't see this message. Uh, you'll probably get something about having to uh, redo your XORG config or something like that, or uh, blacklisting Novu. So I'm gonna continue installation. This one you'll see regardless. Continue installation. Would you like to register the kernel module with DKMS? Now, Make sure you have DKMS installed uh, because this will help you if you reboot your si system and you have just a minor patch to your kernel. Uh, this will rebuild the, uh, the NVIDIA driver for your uh, newer kernel. Uh, this is incredibly useful if you're on something like uh, Tumbleweed or if you're running Leap with a rolling kernel or something else, if you're using a kernel from another repository other than standard. 
do you want to install NVIDIA's 32-bit compatibility libraries? If you run Steam, you will need this. Do the dashy. I think I forgot to do the dashy. An incomplete installation of libglvnd has was found. This is because the new NVIDIA driver uh, uses some of the Mesa OpenGL stuff which is supposed to make things a lot better, especially if you update. Uh, you don't have things like OpenGLX disappear on you, supposedly. So install and overwrite existing files. If I hadn't done that, then things would have probably gone very bad. Things like Steam would not load, uh, OBS would not load, Blender would ha either not load or not function very well. And this is the part that always gets me. It stays stuck on 5%, but if it gets past the 5%, you know you're pretty good. You're in the clear for the rest. But if it fails here, then you've got some other issue and you need to look at the log files. See? And would you like to run the NVIDIA X config utility? This might be useful for those of you who run multiple cards uh, multiple types of cards, so NVIDIA plus AMD, or if you have a graphics accelerator, like, uh, what, what is it, uh, you've got the Quadro, the, hmm. yeah, they've got a, an accelerator card on the enterprise level stuff. But, you know, basically, if you have something like, uh, one of my machines I've got, one card as the main and the other one's uh, uh, video acceleration. But I'm going to say no because I don't need it. I've got one card and everything's fine. Okay, cool. And that is it. Uh, reboot and uh, I che I'll check NVDoc. And if NVDoc shows up with 415.25, then this has been successful. See, absolutely not painless at all. But, 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 let's go into a hypothetical stating, oh my god, the NVIDIA driver is not loading and there isn't a new one. Well, other than reinstalling and I didn't do the dashes. Okay. Uh, DKMS auto install should do everything that you need. That would be a message that you'd find that would break things normally. Okay. Well, never mind. Anywho, that's it for this video. But basically, that DKMS command, uh, DKMS auto install, is all you'll need. If that fails, then you need to reinstall the driver. So, thank you for watching. And if you like this video, please donate to my uh, Libra pay. 
Uh, it helps encourage me to do more videos like this, and the URL is https colon slash slash l i b e r a p a y dot com slash mere slash donate. Any amount uh, helps and helps encourage me to make better co uh, quality movies and stutter a lot less. So, thank you for watching.